see here in the back, were built in place of them. It's where Robert works. This is his depot. Here he is himself, waving his paper. Here's Robert's house, just out past the air mills, on what used to be Green Bank Farm. That's his wife and his daughter, coming down the path here. That's mother and Robert's daughter, Jan. Uh, Jan. That's myself, waving away there. This is our new school, one of our new schools. Uh, it's built in what used to be called the PD Ducky, just below the old Ducky Pond up at Pabdale. Nice bit of school, very fine school, very modern. We're getting very modern up here now, you know, very modern. They've left some of the willow trees, of course, in on the site. That's some of the kids in the playground. That's some of the trees up there at the back was Pabdale. No, here's the Orney Herald on the street in Albert Street. That was the bookshop for the printing. Here's the customs house, and this is Draven and Hedles here. No, and you'll notice it's newly built up as Woolworths. The branch of Woolworths up here. The, they pulled down the old building, Draven and Hedles, and built Woolworths in there. This is Broad Street. It's the head of Castle Street. It used to be a piece and Lowe's, now a bank. Uh, there's Kemp Chuller, Bill Brock Chuller's, Cutness and Gorey. It used to be uh, cabinet makers, Tets. Here's the old post office. No use, no. The Toon Hall door, Chain W. Tate's, Bain the Painters, there's the old saddle shop, bathrooms, and Charlie McGregor's at the top. Here's a view of a Toon Hall again. No change here. Same old place. Here's, uh, this is uh, a view actually of the old Kirk. Uh, we'll start off in the Kirkyard now. We're going to rise up to the top of the spire. This is the St. Magnus Cathedral. This is uh, Kathy and Albert and their two girls in front of their house. That's a daughter of mine here on the left with a red hairband. They're all smiling away here, happy and healthy looking. 